Information is obviously important in the world. You use it a lot in your physical theories, but some people now claim that information is fundamental, that it is the, the most uh, deepest part of reality, and everything is derived from information. I think that everything is derived from the underlying physical reality. I think that, for example, the laws of physics show us that we have two singularities which end time and begin time. And we can have consistency over the whole of the time between the initial and final singularity. Only if we start one of the singularities with zero information, or as they say, everything is at zero entropy, and the other singularity is at infinite entropy. I think that the consistency of the laws of physics require that information be generated in the course of universal history. But it's the laws of physics and not information that's ultimately fundamental. So you would be saying that information yeah. is derivative from the laws of physics as opposed to others saying that the laws of physics are somehow derivative from the concept of information. Exactly. I think there's a tendency amongst people who work with computers, who work with mathematical symbols, to think these symbols, to think of platonic reality as ultimate and a physical reality as a pale reflection <laughs> of this more fundamental right. mathematical reality. I think these people haven't thought sufficiently deeply. Um, one of the things that was very moving for me is a comment which Richard Feynman made when people were asking, why didn't Alan Turing invent the quantum computer? The reason is Alan Turing was fake making his model of what a computer should do based on what a mathematician does. Write symbols using pencils on a piece of paper. Feynman remarked, Alan Turing's problem was he thought he understood pencils and paper. Pencils and paper, though, are physical objects subject to the laws of physics. Why did Alan Turing think that a single symbol, or as we would say, an integer, a whole number, one, two, and three, why should these be fundamental? We know from quantum mechanics that they need not be ultimate reality is continuous, uncountable number of points at the basic physical reality. The numbers, however, arise from discrete quantum states, from the application of these continuous laws to this particular universe we find ourselves in. So mathematical reality is shown by this to be derivative from ultimate physical reality. Mathematics, in other words, is a branch of physics and not vice versa.